one prove each of the following trigonometry identities so you can choose any side right or left and then prove it it is equal to the other side so here 3 sine square a minus 2 is equal to 1 minus 3 cos square a so you see here we have square square so we know that sine square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 right so if i want to do it this side so we see that here we have cos square theta right so we know that cos square theta is equal to 1 so we bring sine to the other side minus sine square theta so here 1 minus 3 this one cos square a this one is a right so theta theta if this one is a then you get negative sine square a so 1 minus 3 times 1 is negative 3 negative 3 times negative you get positive 3 sine square a so 1 minus 3 is negative 2 plus 3 sine square a so you can rearrange it 3 sine square a minus 2 which is proven right B 1 plus 2 tangent square A is equal to 1 minus sine for A divided by cos for A. So we know that when we have A square minus B square, you here you get A minus B, A plus B, right? And we know that 1 is actually 1 square and sine for A is actually sine square A square. So you see here where this one we can make it into 1 minus sine square A. 1 plus sine square a divided by cos for a is equal to cos square a square. Why I arrange it in this way? Because I want to uh, use formula because we know that cos square theta plus sine square theta is equal to 1. So in this formula, we need to use square. which is equal to so 1 plus sine square theta so you see here this one cos plus sine is 1 right so here you see here is 1 minus sine square theta we got cos square theta can you see here so if you bring it this way so 1 minus right so here because i have 1 minus sine so we can see that if 1 minus sine square theta then we are left with cos square theta then this way we can eliminate so this one is cos square this one is theta, that's why this one is theta. This one is A, then this one is A. Alright, time. 1 plus... One plus sine square A is equal to cos square A square. Now, you can eliminate one of this one. which is equal to so 1 plus sine square a over cos square a so 1 over cos square a plus sine square a over cos square a so you see here you have tangent here so this one you can change it into tangent right which is equal to so 1 over cos you get secant square a sine over cos you get tangent square a so are we done yet no this is not similar that but see here you have two tangent square a and we know that we can relate secant and tangent where we know that okay the formula just use red for it so this one the formula sorry on the left side so we know that tangent square theta plus one is equal to secant square theta so here we don't want secant right so we have we can change it to tangent so this one is equal to tangent square because this one is theta, theta, this one is a, plus 1 plus tangent square a. So here tangent plus tangent, we get 2 tangent square a, this one is plus 1. But here, this one is 1 plus 2 tangent square a. So you can see, since this one, so this one is the left hand side, right? So since the right hand side is equal to left hand side, so this one is proven.
<coughs> See, secant A cos secant A minus tangent A is equal to cotangent A. Okay, so we have two here, right and left. So for me, I prefer to start with the, uh, with the side which is a longer equation or complex one because it is easier to make the complex into a simpler one instead of you try to make a simpler one as a, a complex one. But it depends, it depends on you actually. So this one, I'm going to start from the left hand side. So left hand side, so here, secant, cosecant and tangent. So what can we do? So here, secant, cosecant, tangent. So as you know, we, we can have like for all these things, we can have few. Uh, we have we can have few solution. But as long as you can prove it, then it is okay, right? As long as you can prove it. So secant. So I'm going to change it into secant is one over cos a, right? Cos secant is equal to one over sin a tangent is equal to sin a over cos a so this two only right so 1 over cos a sin a so this one if you want to combine you have to make the denominator equal right so time sin over sin so this one minus sin a Sin A, sin A, sin square A divided by cos A, sin A. Uh, so, are we closer to cotangent? Which is equal to 1 minus sin square A divided by cos A, sin A. So, we know that sin square A here, 1 plus So here we know that cos square theta plus sin square theta is equal to 1. So here 1 minus sin is equal to cos square theta is equal to 1 minus sin square theta. So 1 minus sin square theta is equal to cos square A because this one is A cos A sin A. So here this one and this one can be cut off. So you get cos A over sin A which is equal to cotangent A. So since this one is equal to right hand side, so it is proven. B cos square A minus sin square A is equal to 1 minus tangent square A divided 1 plus tangent square A. So I want to start from the right hand side first. Right hand side because from tangent I can make it into cos and sine. So 1 minus but then you can also start from this way. So either way. So 1 minus this one would be tangent is equal to sin square A divided by cos square A divided by tangent 1 plus sin square A divided by cos square A. So we want to combine, right? So we have to make the denominator equal. This one you time cos square A divided by cos square A and also this one. Okay. So here we get uh, cos square A here. Cos square A minus sin square A divided by cos square A Okay, up here and then down here 1 this one would become cos square a right so this one we have cos square a this one is plus plus sin square a divided by cos square a so you see here cos and cos down here we can cut so here we know that cos a cos square a plus sin square a is equal to 1 right because we know that cos square theta plus sine square theta is equal to 1. So this one is basically 1. So this one is equal to 1. So we are left with cos square A minus sine square A. And you can see that this one is equal to the left hand side. So proven.
E cotangent square theta minus tangent square theta is equal to cosecant square theta minus secant square theta. So I'm going to start from the left hand side. Left hand side. So I have cotangent and tangent. So here cotangent is equal to 1 over tangent square theta right minus tangent square theta where we know that tangent is sine over cos so this one 1 over tangent is equal to cos square theta over sine square theta it is opposite with tangent this one is minus sine square theta divided by cos square theta because we know that tangent theta is equal to sine theta over cos theta right so when we square this one we square this one so we will get square and square so here when you have fraction and you want it to combine you need to make the denominator equal so this one you have sine square and this one you have cos square right so this one you have to multiply with cos square theta divided by cos square theta and this one you have to multiply with sine square theta divided by sine sine square theta so here you will have a denominator of cos square theta sine square theta so up here you have you see here cos time cos so you have cos square theta square minus sine square theta square so you see here this one is equal to a square minus b square which is equal to a minus b a plus b so this one is so you see here cos square theta minus sine square theta times cos square theta this is minus so this one is plus sine square theta divided by cos square theta sine square theta so you see here cos plus sine we know it is equal to 1 so here we have cos square theta so here we have cos square theta minus sine square theta divided by cos square theta sine square theta so you see here you can separate so this one is cos square theta divided by cos square theta sine square theta minus because this one sine square theta divided by cos square theta sine square theta where you can cancel out this thing and this one is sine right so we are left with So this one is 1 over sine square theta. 1 over sine is cosecant square theta because this one is square. And 1 over cos is equal to secant. This one is minus minus secant square theta. So we start with the left hand side and then this one is equal to the right hand side. So it is proven. So you do, you do, you does not necessarily need to start from the left hand side. You can also start from right hand side and try to prove that it is equal because in this question there's a lot of there's a lot of possible way that you can prove it as long as you can prove that right hand side uh, left hand side and right hand side is equal okay so f sine square theta divided by 1 plus cos theta is equal to 1 minus cos theta so i want to start from this one which is uh, le left hand side so left hand side so i have sine square theta so because this one i have cos right so we know that sine square theta we know that sine square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 so sine square theta is equal to 1 minus cos square theta so this one okay, left hand side is equal to never mind this one right so i just directly write 1 minus cos square theta divided by 1 plus cos theta 
So here you see here, this one is minus cos square theta, right? So 1 is actually 1 square because 1 square is 1. So here you see here, this one I haven't deleted yet. So a square minus b square is equal to this one. So 1 is actually 1 square. So here I can expand it to be this way. So here 1 minus cos square theta, it will become 1 minus. So a minus b, a cos theta. 1 plus cos theta divided by 1 plus cos theta so plus and plus can be cut off so we are left with 1 minus cos theta and we can see that this one is equal to the right hand side so it is proven okay g Tangent square theta cos secant square theta minus 1 is equal to 1. So, I mean, if you want to start from 1 from right hand side, it will be very hard. So, we are going to start from left hand side. So, here tangent square and cos secant square. So, we should see the formula which have tangent square and cos secant square. So, here we know that tangent square theta plus 1 is equal to secant square theta and another one 1 plus cotangent square theta is equal to cosecant square theta so here we have cosecant theta minus 1 so cosecant minus 1 if you bring it to this side we have cotangent square theta is equal to cosecant square theta minus 1 so here which is equal to so you have tangent square theta and cosecant square theta minus 1 is equal to cotangent square theta so we know that cotangent is equal to 1 over tangent which is 1 over tangent square theta because this one is square, this one is square so this one and this one is equal so we can cut it which is equal to 1 so 1 is equal to right hand side so this is proven So H1 minus 2 sine square theta divided by cos theta minus sine theta is equal to cos theta plus sine theta. So I want to start from the left hand side first. But for me, I prefer to start with the longer one first. So this one, one two, sine square theta. So the formula which have sine square theta, so we know that sine square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1. So we see here this one, so we have cos and sine, so we can try to convert this one, which is sine and cos, so we can calculate with this one. So this one is sine square theta plus cos square theta minus 2 sine square theta divided by cos theta minus sine theta. So here, you see here, when I do it this one, I can make it into a, a square minus b square, sorry, a a square minus b square which is equal to a minus b a plus b so in this uh, sine minus negative 2 sine is negative sine square theta plus cos square theta divided by cos theta minus sine theta which is equal to cos square theta minus sine square theta divided by cos theta minus sine Theta. So you can see this one is in the form of a square minus b square where this one cos minus sine can be cos theta minus sine theta. You see here a minus b times a plus b cos theta plus sine theta divided by cos theta minus sine theta. So you see here this one and this one can be cancelled out. So the answer on your left now, so you see after we cancel out this one, we only have cos theta plus sine theta. And you can see that this one is equal to right hand side. So we can say that it is proven.